What's up guys, RK here, the non-hippie farmer, and I wanted to give you an update on the back porch system. As you can see, we cycled it and we got some, uh, you know, some different lettuce, spinach, kale, uh, basil going on here. But as you can see, they're all reaching for the sunlight because of the overhang on my back porch. And so I wanted to put something out that can just get the sun. And so I had these old NFT pipes left over. And so I wanted to show you what I've done. So I added an extra bed because I know that it has to be uh, filtered. And so uh, this is going to be like a biofilter. So it's running off the same pump, but two different beds with two different bell siphons. So this bed has this bell siphon running in a bucket. And this one I just made out of one inch pipe. So this pipe here sets the level um, this cap is here just because I drilled the hole wrong and I just had to cap it off and so this is an air break it goes down to the bottom so whenever the water drops below that it will fire off and then I had trouble I had to keep on going back because the the uh, the one inch T uh, it wouldn't it wouldn't fire the bell siphon so I have a one inch to three quarter inch um, so these are three quarter inch pipes that fire the bell siphon and you see it runs into I have a, a bottle that the bottom of the bottle is cut off and the uh, some other filters in there just to make sure everything is filtered out before it goes down the pipes now here was the the tricky part so whenever the bell siphon would fire if I just ran it down the pipes the pipes would overflow and so what I did is I put a half inch pipe at the bottom of the bucket and so the water will just drain out of that but when the bell siphon fires it can't drain fast enough so the water will actually rise in this bucket to about the bottom of this two inch pipe and run down and so every time the bell siphon fires it'll get some some water so a couple tweaks that I had to make is this this one inch pipe um, if it's too low the water travels too fast and then it won't rise up in the bucket so I had to make sure it was pretty high um, and and the other thing is if it doesn't reach that height of that hole in that two inch bucket or the two inch pipe then you just got to put a couple things into this bucket that will raise the water maybe a couple rocks or a couple bricks or something just to make sure it reaches the bottom of that two inch pipe and so that is the update this will be getting a lot more sun than everything else, which hopefully, you know, maybe we'll use it to just grow some more kale or spinach or something. And I will keep you updated.